Corey. Great guitar. Man, that sounded good. Uh, Corey Congelio here today. Paul here, Music Villa, Bozeman, Montana. And uh, we're doing a Martin event here, and we thank you for joining us and Always performing for us. That was cool. I mean, what you just Thanks. did there was like it, it, the whole thing. Yeah. Uh, what you just played is like perfect for that guitar. I mean, you always do that. You're good at that. Thanks. But if I was going to pick up that guitar, that's what I'd want to play. That sounded good. I could tell when I first played this guitar that it had this rich low end but wasn't overwhelming. Yeah. Like a dreadnought might be. So when I went to the drop D thing, yeah. I could hear that the note would really stay intact. Guitar. So, I don't even know if you know this or not, but what you're playing there is a Music Villa Custom, and uh, we went back to the factory, picked out woods, as we do quite often, a couple times a year. Right, right. Uh, I found this piece of Coca Bolo, mm -hmm. and I thought, this is really a cool piece of wood, and then I didn't know what I was going to do with it, and then I, uh, and you've actually demoed this guitar before. Last year, mm -hmm. we had the OM just like right. this. And it's got a larger sound hole. So this is the same guitar, same specs. Right. But we did them with Indian sides. Rosewood. Now this right. one's Coca Bolo. Sure. So it's just a fancier kind of a piece of wood. Mm -hmm. Not, you know, better or worse. It's just a different right. tone. But it's a beautiful piece of wood. So sure. it's Coca Bolo. Uh, this is an Addy top. Um, so it's an OM guitar, but this we did this larger sound hole, yeah. which I don't think is done on an OM. No, I, think, no. I think it's the only one that we that is done like this. Right. I mean, they did it on a Dreadnought. Uh, the Clarence White model, you know, mm -hmm. there's the old, the stories of how the, the it was worn away. Yeah. And then he liked it. Yep. And then when they built him a guitar, they made it larger. Mm -hmm. Right. So we did it on an OM. And I can't even really explain what, what it's doing. Like, I don't even know. What, I'm not sure I could you know, either. It, it just you know. sounds good. Though. Yeah. No, this, it, 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 this particular guitar has, maybe it's the combination of the Coca Bowl and the Adirondack yeah. that really That's giving gives it, the it power. a new, yeah, the power, but there's like a real richness. You know, a custom shop guitar always feels like uh, you, you took a, a standard Martin and you put it under a microscope a little bit mm -hmm. and you brought out like you said, oh, there's there's some frequencies, there's some frequencies, and then they just come out, yeah. pull out a little bit more because of the woods. You know, these yeah. these uh, more exotic tone woods, even though they may be in the same species as a rosewood or a right. mahogany or whatever, they they all have their different tonal characteristics. You know, I was with a rep one time, and he had these pieces of of tone wood, and he'd hold them up to a microphone and he'd tap them with mm -hmm. his finger, and each one would have a different right, different tone, like, like yeah, a, totally. almost like a the thud would be the timber, denser. Yeah, yeah it yeah. was really cool. You could hear, I mean, the maple would have the snap, the rosewood would have the thud. Totally. It was really Same cool. Same with the tops. I mean, when they're, yeah. when they're picking out tops for this guitar, I mean, it's, you know, because it, it does cost you, you know. I mean, yeah. when you're getting premium woods and you're getting Addy uh, like that, you know, it's going to go under, a, you know, they put it through the light yeah. and they're going to test it and all that. And sure. so, you know, and, and Addy, it's, it's becoming harder to get yeah. a really nice piece of Addy. For so. sure. Um, so it's a premium. It and, really is, uh, yeah. And this is just a cool guitar. Waverly tuners. Yeah. Uh, you know the neck. Yep. You love that Full neck. Full thickness neck. Full thickness neck. Yeah. I love the white buttons on there, yeah. too. It looks think, great. Yep. And the matching uh, uh, in, with the Martin logo, no CF. And, right. Uh, so is hybrid. this like a tortoise head plate or something here? This is Coca Bolo. Coca Bolo also. Coca -Bolo, yeah, which is yeah. Also yep. often done like a, a lot of times they'll put like a, even a Brazilian plate yeah. on there because yeah. it's, you know, just a small piece. Totally. You know? Yeah, yeah that's, that's cool to match it with to the, match back. the back. Yeah. yeah. And uh, I love the ivory inlay. Mm -hmm. Just the whole thing, a little bit of herringbone there. Yeah. Uh, beautiful guitar, sunburst, uh, 30s sunburst finish. and Teardrop pickguard yeah. on this style of guitar, yeah, too. For sure. Yeah, really cool. It's just cool. Um, yeah. So that's it. It's one of our customs. and I've been playing this one all day. Yeah. It's I a know. lot of fun. It's, it's, There's always one or two I, I find here, I and they just keep calling me. I know. You know, it was be and it was these two, the two that's, that we've been working with. That's cool. Well, yeah, I'm, for sure. I'm glad you found them, and uh, oh, we yeah. got to demo them with you. We'll just uh, let you do your thing, and we'll let you hear, it, let everyone hear it. And thanks again for being here. That's, My pleasure. Uh, yeah. It's always great to have you. We'll uh, we'll go upstairs and watch your performance and cool. sell some guitars. Yeah, and come on down, Music Villa, and uh, we'll see you all soon. Thanks for watching.